What's up, guys? Uh, what's up, everyone? Welcome to Finance with, with Tony. Uh, I'm Tony, and uh, here we, we will share ideas uh, about frugal lifestyle, uh, hopefully soon. But in first uh, videos, I'll, I'll make uh, um, observation of my city, which is uh, the Novosibirsk city. Uh, the capital of Siberia and uh, uh, I, I, I invite you to the quick uh, to the quick random sightseeing tour uh, on, on the other side of the street you can see McDonald's on the background and uh, um, I don't have uh, a specific plan uh, but uh, for, for our tour, but uh, we can just uh, hit the road and see what happens. Uh, uh, this is a uh, red prospect. Uh, is a central city, uh, central uh, central uh, central street of Novosibirsk city. And uh, uh, in, in Russian it's called Krasny Prospect, Red, red Prospect, uh, Red Street, uh, because of communist era. And, uh, uh, at the moment, uh, uh, at the moment, we are under under the. Arc, uh, which is uh, which is uh, the, that actually is a trans trans uh, Sibir railroad uh, trans Sibir railroad. It was just under my head <laughs> like a ceiling. <laughs> um, so and. Uh, on the other side of the street, we can s see some buildings uh, with different purposes, different uh, 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 different offers, or, and different markets. It's medical, healthcare stuff. stuff. On this part, we just passed. Uh, Business center called Crystal Business Center. Uh, a lot of noise, you know. It's a coffee shops and uh, bakeries and also graffitis in the exterior. Here's a parking. Uh, I mean, it's a. Uh, Uh, classical, I guess, and also you can see many people with uh, dogs. Uh, some people with dogs and uh, on scooters, electric scooters, and also the. Some government building. It's uh, on the on the back uh, back uh, the back side. It's uh, I believe uh, now it's uh, it belongs to uh, federal. Uh, I would say is better. It's former KGB. Hopefully it's not uh, it's not a secret. Uh, well, uh, actually it's an open information. Uh, well, and uh, here's a here's a, a bit outlook for you. Uh, 
on the background uh, on the background you can see also Sovietske 64 which is a business center uh, that uh, uh, that was the home of my company uh, first six years from 2013 um, I I made the video before about this building uh, also in Novosibir city you can see some outdoor uh, a lot of outdoor advertising I'm pretty sure that it works yeah oh sorry <laughs> um, yeah digital but outdoor advertising pretty spacious I would say right uh, because uh, Novosibirsk uh, has just 100 uh, years history it's quite a new city and that's why uh, the architecture plan plan of this city uh, comparing to to the uh, to the uh, comparing to, to Europe uh, it's uh, uh, it's totally different. I mean, uh, uh, we have uh, we have uh, really wide streets, Central Street at, at, at least uh, in the city center. Uh, but uh, actually, uh, it's. Uh, uh, it's typical case for uh, cities in, in, in former Soviet Union. Some uh, some things uh, reminds us um, uh, era of communism, and it's uh, sort I guess. It's Stalin style. Uh, it, it's uh, it's uh, it is the on the background we can see uh, some neglect, neglected building. Uh, it's uh, I mean this elements a bit neglected, and uh, this is the dormir. Uh, Dormidor or of uh, one of the universities. Novosibirsk has uh, dozens of universities, and uh, this is a typical example of uh, of uh, uh, street retail, and I mean it's taco or something like that. I, I'm not really sure how, how it, uh, what would be the best analogy, but something like uh, fast, uh, it's fast, uh, it, 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 it's fast food, definitely, and uh, Novosibirsk has, generally speaking, Novosibirsk has rock button prices uh, in all uh, in all uh, niche business niche and uh, I guess um, the prices will start from uh, one dollar fifty cents I guess uh, maybe with, with from a couple of dollars uh, and also uh, some outdoor uh, outdoor advertising uh, uh, related to Victor Victory Day. Uh, that's why uh, some my so it was so red. It is so red. It is so red. Uh, so. Greece, <laughs> I mean Greece 
style. <laughs> uh, actually, uh, the ancient, ancient Greece uh, shared and shared many things, many uh, uh, in culture to to the uh, to the Byzantine Empire and from the Byzantine Empire uh, it was uh, transition to uh, to modern Russia <laughs> I mean uh, yeah, of course uh, uh, initial initially to, to the uh, to the Russian Empire and Soviet Union but at the end of the day uh, when it comes to architecture, when it comes to culture, Russia and Siberia, which is uh, uh, Siberia that is just a part of Russia, uh, definitely more. Uh, it uh, definitely belongs to European culture. Uh, boutiques and uh, some uh, other uh, other businesses and uh, here is a uh, Lutheran uh, Lutheran confession. I, I'm not pretty sure how it would say, but uh, it says that it is uh, it, it is sort of offices of uh, sort of office so sort of an office of Lutheran confession. Uh, I I did mention before that. Uh, that uh, Siberia and Novosibirsk city is a mountain pot of cultures and uh, we have all possible religions represented here Siberia we can we can find not only original H&M but also I guess it's a sport bar H&M <laughs> these things uh, coexist <laughs> I mean original H&M stores and H&M brand for uh, sport bars So, uh, we, we are almost the government buildings, I mean, many, many buildings belong to government and or occupied by government organizations and also we are uh, almost uh, uh, it's uh, near the uh, next uh, subway station. Um, we just did the way between two subway stations. Uh, thanks for watching. Remember to subscribe, guys. Uh, feel free to press uh, thumbs up. Have a great day.